No, go right ahead. You smell like shit. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. I was just listening to Huey Lewis in the news. Oh. Their last record was rather eclectic. Is this yours? Oh, hold your horses there, buddy. Before we get to this very spooky episode of OTK Reacts, today's video is sponsored by Surfshark VPN. I gotta keep myself protected. With Surfshark VPN, my identity is protected, so no goons will be getting into my accounts anytime soon. And even if they did, I'd be quickly notified by Surfshark VPN, so I'll be ready and equipped to change my passwords. Because with Surfshark, all your internet activity is fully encrypted, which means the secrets of your browsing data <laughs> We can take to the grave. And with the personal data security reports that I receive quarterly now, I can sleep easy knowing that I have complete control over my digital footprint. And you can too. Or maybe you just want to watch shows that aren't region locked. So click the link in the description or even scan that little QR code that's moving around right now. Ooh, ooh, trying to get it. And you can get three months of Surfshark VPN for free. And with our promo code OTK, enjoy 83% off as well. And if it's not up your alley, there's a 30 day money back guarantee. So thank you Surfshark VPN for sponsoring today's video and enjoy. Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of OTK Reacts. Today, we've got Emma. Hello, that's me. We're gonna watch some spooky, scary, Halloween-y freaking videos. Starting with this one. Hola, este video lo estoy grabando para ti porque eres una persona especial para mí. Si eres tan, tan. Why is he sh <laughs> Bro, do you have like an iPhone like three? What is that? <laughs> Why is it so little? I think it's a very it average. Stupid. I think it's a very average it size stupid you for have, the phone. You have big hands. It's not the size of the iPhone. It's how well you can send death threats. Home to the most powerful spectacles in existence. And I'm about to build it in Minecraft. What are you doing? Oh, it, it just auto-played a video. How I built the entire universe in Minecraft? Yeah, it just auto-played off of your um, recommended. That's kind of weird. I don't watch him. But it's in, it was your recommended. I don't watch him. Auto, I don't know who that is. That was your auto-play on your computer. Let's just find another video. Oh, what a big slice. Oh, the New York flop. One bite. Everybody knows the rules. Well, it's not Dorsia, but it still quenches an empty stomach. So what scares you? Stairs. Scares. Stairs. The stairs. The stairs? Like Scare you? Yes, I'm very scared of stairs. Let's dissect this. Yeah, me it's even me too. It's in Hollywood, yeah. Oh, oh, this is going to hurt. Oh, this is a fake video. Yeah, this is not. I need this something. Is not authentic. I need something real. <laughs> so why the hat? Does it help you? Yes, it helps me. What's this? Oh my gosh! You might want to get out of the way. <laughs> We can't be reacting to this. Okay, well, what scares you? Kids? <laughs> it, just, it just like sharded a little bit. <laughs> you want to know what scares me? <laughs> <coughs> Smoke machines and also death. That skeleton is gonna shoot me. <laughs> <laughs> why, why do they have a fucking box around their webcam? Like it's an actual webcam. It's just a fucking photo. It's a photo. Does this make you feel like you're gonna vomit? <laughs> I fucking. 
fucking hate VTubers. Is that even a VTuber? It's a PNG tuber. Fuck you. Let's watch real people die. These two aren't training for an upcoming sporting event or a bodybuilding contest. They've got their eyes on a different prize. Their frat house's annual fart competition. Tighten your sphincter, boy! For me, it's, it's general. It hurts. Do you like a slice? Can I really? Yes. What happened to this show? This show used to be awesome. Are all these stories real? No. Oh, that's lame. Making sure he could fire. What the fuck? It, we're not, we can't. I'm not watching this. There's got to be a better one. Deep fried. There wasn't much that didn't make Ed see red. At the He's just stupid. Stupid Ed. Oh my god! <laughs> I would not hire a guy like that around heavy machinery. That doesn't sound like a good idea. Yeah, he's like not very smart. He's got anger issues. He's not good at anything, honestly. You're fired! For hitting his own, breaking his own thumb. <laughs> Workplace injury. <laughs> Imagine if I fired Trevor after doing this to him. <laughs> That's enough. That's enough. Turn it off. <laughs> That's enough. It won't that's enough. It won't, it won't. That's enough smoke, Emeru. Thinking in terms of spite. They got a therapist to talk about a fake guy that they made up. A psychotherapist. Yeah, because he's fucking crazy. You like that one? And how they can get back at the fucking psycho. <laughs> His unsuspecting target, the foreman, who was working on a vat of hydrochloric acid. Job is working on a vat of hydrochloric acid. He has to stir it. He just looks at it, he stirs. You can't even stir it. It'll just get dissolved. It's fucking acid. He has to stir it. <laughs> oh! <laughs> stir. We're going in circles. It's not cement, it's not gonna get dry. <laughs> Ed goes hand to time out. He's Who? taking notes on the acid, you see? He That's was his taking job. notes, you're right. How much you want to bet? Angry Ed is the one who winds up in the vat of acid. He would deserve it. He can't do anything right. What the fuck? <laughs> we do not, okay, listen. Our employees at OTK, we, if they get injured on the job, we don't fire them and berate them. We just, we gotta get that out there. Remember that time that E Rob kicked me in the leg and I fell over and everyone laughed at me? <laughs> I know, actually. Wait, do you want to see? Yeah. Wait, Wait hold on. Okay, we, no, we gotta, we gotta okay. watch what happens okay. to Angry Ed. Taking a bath. <laughs> <laughs> that person, I'm sure, went through an excruciatingly painful death because he was suffering a total body burn simultaneously. The acid quickly burned through his skin fries his eyeballs and pours into his wide open mouth. The acid fries his eyeballs. I feel like he could easily like grab the ledge. You're forgetting something. His eyeballs are fried. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but he still had hands. He could grab, he... Why don't you tell him that? Oh, wait! <laughs> wait! <laughs> you didn't, wait, you didn't realize it was him? No! No, wait, wait, the you, dude just picked him up. You he, predicted right. He picked him up like a fucking doll and just threw him in. Look at the fuck out of the way. Okay. Gets back up, doesn't help her up at all. Goes and scores. Goal, motherfucker. Puts the hand up right in her face. Shit talks her too. Look, bitch. Look, look, he said, <laughs> look, he said, he said, he said <laughs> bitch. <laughs> and then started walking away. Holy fuck, he bought the alpha as fuck! That was a dick move. Yeah, but but he won. He did win. Actually, he lost. My team won in the end, so it didn't even matter. Sometimes I have dreams where like I try to run, but my legs don't work. What are you running from? You're up. <laughs> That's enough. That's... That's enough. We don't have to keep it burns. It actually burns. Scary and then sort by newest videos. Never play these scary games. 
Let's look into this. Never play these scary games, part six. Why was he talking to the camera like this? I Never play he... these six scary elevator games. I thought he had no shirt from like here on down. Never play these scary games, part six. That's just his funny shirt. Damn, he really bangs these out in one sitting. He swaps the shirt. These are punishments that are worse than. Why are you? <laughs> Why is he sideways? <laughs> Let's watch this. Let's watch this terrible punishment video. Up first might be one of the most brutal forms of punishment ever. I would hate and to be crushed it's by an crushed elephant. By elephant. The person will be tied to the ground or held there by other people, and an elephant will then come over and step on them slowly, killing them. But what makes this even worse for the victim and more painful is that these elephants are trained to kill them as slowly as they possibly can. Next up is dehydration. During this punishment- On one hand, oh, I'm sorry. On one hand, you can be killed by an elephant, or on the other hand, they just stop giving you water. Which one's it gonna be? Which one's it gonna be? The, the water, right? Hold on. This punishment is worse than death. This is a process that can last more than days. So just imagine the pain and anxiety these victims are feeling. I would much rather just die than go through this. <laughs> these are punishments that are worse than don't you die anyways? Yeah, if you get crushed to death by an no, elephant, isn't that the punishment? Yeah, but like, he's like, I would rather just die instantly, but I feel like everyone would rather just die instantly if they're that's gonna, true. like, this guy is just saying stuff that's obvious. I f that's obvious, I feel like. This is what I love about shorts creators and people that make content for TikTok. Sorry. Okay. Except most of them put no effort in. Most of them do not give a single fuck about the content that they're making. They have absolutely zero, zero idea or care about how to make content and that they'll make the, the lowest effort shit so that I can watch it on YouTube and make part. Let's watch the next one. This is what would happen if Putin <laughs> nuked Ukraine. Wait, Up wait, first, wait. This is how long it takes to decompose a body in different things, part one. Up first is a microwave. <laughs> it would take five. This is the scary story about the flu. There was a flu. <laughs> 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 yeah, a young girl named Cindy who loved to play the flute. Her father didn't support her. He thought it was a complete waste of time. And one night when Cindy was practicing, her dad came into the room and told her to stop playing. Cindy said no. Her dad then took the flute and threw it on the ground, breaking it. Aren't those things made of like metal? Metal. Like, yeah. That's strong dad. She then went down to the kitchen and grabbed a knife and walked into her dad's office. Cindy then looked at him and said, I'm sorry, dad. I'll start focusing on more important things. Her dad then smiled and walked over to her and gave her a hug. Cindy then drove the knife into his neck and said, I don't need negative people in my life, even if they're my father. <laughs> this is the scariest. <laughs> Damn, that is a very scary story about the flute. Oh my God. Jesus. Let's watch his most famous short. Holy shit, 25 million. Pictures that broke the internet. Up first is the behind the scenes photo <laughs> of the MGM intro, most incredible rice wave ever. That shit was all over the floor. That shit <laughs> broke the internet though. It was all over the floor. Yeah, it might've been all over the floor, but if, if that shit broke the internet. Yeah, but it was like definitely. Oh, it was photoshopped floor. again, man. Finally, is a picture of a pilot who is that flying is, a plane. Okay, time. Who the fuck is watching this TikTok? Who is like, yeah, these these are really awesome photos. These are pictures that fooled the entire world. Part six. <laughs> <laughs> I need to sneeze and it didn't come out. Do you want a paper towel? Uh, um, there's like nothing there though. I don't know what that was. <laughs> Probably the fucking smoke <laughs> that you've been blowing up your nose for an hour. A ghost sneeze. Illegal names you cannot name your kids. Up first is Facebook. A few years ago, Mexico had a problem with parents naming their kids Facebook. So eventually they said enough is enough and they banned the name Facebook from their country. Next up is Sarah. In Morocco, they banned the name Sarah because most of their names are Arabic and Sarah spelled S-A-R-A-H is considered the Jewish Hebrew version. Finally is Adolf Hitler. Now, <laughs> why'd you laugh, man? Facebook, Sarah, <laughs> and Adolf Hitler. 
What kind of person do you think you are? A gay one. What? You just come out on my show? No. Up first is this picture. Horse. Horse. If you saw the mountains, it means you are very bored with your life <laughs> and you want a fresh start. If you saw the horses, it means that you've been very lonely and there has been nothing to do. You always try and make plans, but people just don't want to do anything. What the fuck was that? Why did he just insult us for 30 seconds long? Lion. I see trees, man. The first thing you saw was lion? The face is the first thing I saw. Let me guess. You must be really uh, thoughtful and caring, but no one ever wants to hang out with you because they secretly hate how thoughtful and caring you are. It means you love doing things in groups and never alone. Also, you're very needy and always get what you want. But if you saw the lion's face in the tree, it means that you are a natural leader and that people always come to you for guidance and advice. Is that true? <laughs> um. Can I have some advice? <laughs> yeah, what are you I've been feeling down because nobody wants to hang out with me. Just give and up. No, I'll give up. <laughs> Just stop trying. Damn. Skull. If you saw the two astronauts I saw the two astronauts. I saw the skull. That's so stupid that you'd see that. Okay, but like, the eyes are the biggest must, part of okay, the picture. Okay, you have a very short temper, don't you? <laughs> no one wants to hang out. <laughs> if you saw the two astronauts first and Earth in the background, it means that you have a very hard time finding friends, but when you do, <laughs> they're your friends what for life. What the fuck? But if you what did I do to deserve this shit, man? How can seeing two fucking astronauts on a on a fucking piece of screen? Saw the skull first. It means that death fascinates you, and you constantly wonder what happens when you die. It's just fortune telling, man. It's not that deep. Kind yeah. Of thing. Okay. The way you're like, okay, you're kind of like waving it around. Oh. I see face. I see the Eiffel Tower. I see face. Really? Yeah. I saw the eyes first. You must be really mouth. fucking stupid. And you yeah. must you must also have no self-worth. You must really be an awful person. And also <laughs> Yeah. And also, <laughs> okay, what else? And but you like to you like to see it's the little things <laughs> that, <laughs> that matter. You should make these. Let's see. A person walking with an umbrella. It means that some days you get sad and you just don't know why. Also, you always wonder what more you could be doing to better your life. But if you saw the person's face first, it means that the first thing you notice about somebody new is their eyes. You also love driving around and listening to music and going out to eat with your friends. No way, I do like music and going out to eat. Hey, Ludwig, what's going on, man? Yo, you like them? Yeah. I'm uh I'm filming I'm filming a YouTube video right now actually. Oh, all right. What's the video? Fun stuff. We're watching TikToks and whatever picture you see first reveals what kind of person you are. There's this kid named Sebastian. He's made 50 videos in a row. You're, you're watching TikToks and but also reacting to them? Yeah, it's this great new uh, <laughs> yeah, strategy yeah. we came up with recently. Emmeru's picture just revealed that she fucking hates everybody and and is an awful human being so yeah, like I don't even want to said like five times in a row it was like you have no friends and you're a very lonely guy yeah well that's just how I see things okay cool we're enjoying it we're loving life right right oh sh you know what shucks I forgot I actually gotta go this sounds great this call was great though but you guys have fly I hope a good picture comes up Hold on. What do you what do you see? I saw the well I saw the two pink faces and then I saw the psychopaths who was that guy? That was my best friend Ludwig. Oh. But he doesn't think I'm too cool. And also I have a hard time making friends and I'm very lonely. I'm constantly moving, but I'm never settling down. I'm never stopping. Is that Wolverine? Yeah. From the That's front. him? Yeah. That's what I, I knew I saw that. You saw the Wolverine. It means that you are very brave and that you're a very big Marvel fan. <laughs> it's okay, man. 
It's okay, man. Fuck.